The new resource officers will be assigned to five middle schools. One of them is Bel Air Middle. It has more than 1,200 students. Anything to support the community, to support the kids in this building, safety is our number one priority. The other middle schools include Falston, North Harvard, Patterson Mill, and Southampton. Schools across the district can also expect upgraded security cameras and improved police communications equipment. We have secure schools here in Hartford County, but we want to make sure we buttress and, and make them as secure as possible. The county executive wants to spend $1.2 million on school safety next year. $773,000 is being proposed for school resource officers, $325,000 for school security cameras, and $100,000 for police communications equipment. The county executive is investing another $250,000 for a 24-hour crisis center for mental health and addiction. That's seen as an important key to the county school superintendent. We need to know who they are, and we really need to recognize when there is trauma there, when their emotions are in an upheaval. Pending a vote by the county council, the sheriff says he's ready to start hiring. What that means for the Hartford County Sheriff's Office is going to be an additional seven positions. Um, we are advertising for those positions as lateral deputies starting today. The county executive says he'll also follow through with plans to start replacing open classrooms with enclosed ones. Now besides the middle schools that we've mentioned, the county is also putting a resource officer in the Center for Educational Opportunity. Now the county executive will present his budget to the county council in two weeks. It will include this latest security plan. At Bel Air High School, Tim Tootin, WBAL-TV 11 News.